morning everyone welcome to sunday morning so my partner's mom is coming to visit us we're going to go to a christmas decor warehouse it's like a pop-up um warehouse so yep yeah, i think it's pretty close by so we're just gonna go there just check out some christmas decor um i don't think we're gonna buy anything for our place just yet but we will just kind of look around and see um what we fancy when we actually decide to start decorating the place i really want a christmas tree this year i really want one it's currently a very cloudy day again in Melbourne. Just wearing a black t-shirt, jeans, and some socks. So yeah, um, I'm pretty excited about this place. Um, based on what my partner's described, it looks pretty good. Sorry, the TV's on. Um, yeah. I really want real bubbles this year, because I always used to just get like those plastic bubbles back in Hong Kong. Um, but I really want glass ones. And because we've got carpet, um, it's probably going to be okay if they start falling off. Like, I don't... I'm not afraid that they're just gonna smash on the ground. <laughs> oh wow. This place is so cool, like they have so many decorations, like it's massive, it is insane. And oh my gosh, they have so many fairy lights, Christmas lights. Hmm. Makes me want to think of like what I want to, or how I want to decorate my filming room when I finally get a chance. But oh my gosh, this is so cool. So I'll leave the address down in the description box down below if you guys would like to check it out. Oh, I really like these. So they've got like um, golden bobbles and they have like these. I would call them rose gold. So cool. And I think they're only like $4.30 each. So a couple of these. And your Christmas tree is set. It's so pretty. Ooh, I've even got a lighter one. This one kind of looks like a peachy one. Oh, this place is so amazing. It's called the Christmas Cave. I just looked it up. So many cute things in this warehouse it's so cool i just oh, i love christmas i love christmas and i'm really happy that i'm going to be able to really decorate this year so as you guys can see there's like heaps of decorations i find it so weird they have a, a santa pinata pinata at christmas that's so weird um they also have these guys a bit creepy i don't know i find dolls creepy the swat team has arrived Alright guys, so we are back home and that place is so cool. So again, it was called the Christmas Cave. It's just giving us ideas on how to decorate the place and yeah, it's just going to be really cool. I'm just really excited that I can finally decorate my place. Um, so my partner and I are probably just going to go back in the next few weeks, just, you know, when, th when we can. And I'm not really sure what Christmas tree we'll get. We were kind of looking at maybe the fiber optic trees. Um, and then the theme, like the colors, um, we're going to go for red. Um, green and gold um, are those the only three colors yeah so just like the traditional Christmas colors um, I did see like rose gold bubbles and I really wanted them but again we're gonna stick to those colors um, but by the way those rose gold bubbles they were like almost gone like I think that was the most popular color there because all the other colors were still fully stocked except for those rose gold ones so what is the agenda for the rest of the day not really sure. I'm going to do some editing and then later my partner and I are going to go to the supermarket. We just need to buy a couple of things for the rest of the week. And hmm, I'm not really sure. I might have to iron my work stuff. I do have a short work week. I've only got two work days this week, so that's pretty cool. And then I fly up to Sydney. Again, I'm not really sure if I can tell you guys, but stay tuned. It's going to be a really exciting trip. All right, for lunch, I'm just going to pan fry some of these dumplings. These are chive and pork dumplings from... And hope. Cool, so the dumplings are now done. I'm gonna show you guys, well, where am I? <laughs> I'm gonna show you guys um, how to make my sauce. Just basically use a little bit of soy sauce. Like, this is the only bowl we have, so I'm just gonna work with what I have. So, just a little bit. And then I add more vinegar, so I just got this one from, I think it's Coles. Two parts vinegar, one part soy sauce. I just I just like the vinegary acidic taste and I feel it also helps break down the oil in the dumplings 
Um, so yeah, that's what we're gonna have for lunch. Um, and then I think later we're gonna go to my partner's mum's house. We're just gonna get a few more things um, that he's left over there. Alright, as you guys saw, the, the kitties were so cute. They were just um, playing in the cube boxes. I think my partner used them as DVD stands. I think they're little bookshelves, I think. DVD towers. Um, so yeah, we just picked them up and um, we're just gonna bring them home, clean them up, and then I don't know what we're gonna put in them. Probably hit the DVDs. Um, and now we're heading off to Coles to grab a few essentials. Bonjour. I have no idea why I just did that. Anyway. Um, today is Monday evening, so I've been at home for quite some time now. My partner and I had dinner, um, we had rissoles for dinner, that was amazing, it was really good. We got these ones from Coles, they're like just pre-made ones that you just need to cook yourselves, and yeah, it was pretty good. Today was pretty, pretty busy at work, um, I have to admit, like at the end of it, I was just like, I just want to go home. If you guys don't know, my work schedule is pretty much like Monday, I work, Tuesday, I'm off. Um, Wednesday, Thursday and Friday I work. In the next few weeks I'm hoping to drop one more day. Um, I really just want to do three days at work at most because yeah, it's just, I don't know. I just find it hard to cope with. Like I said a couple of times, I'm really trying to make YouTube like a real priority because I really want to make this my job. And by you guys watching and liking and commenting, is definitely helping me get to that goal so I'm really trying to work hard for that I don't know I feel like if I could do sorry I'm looking for stuff that I'm gonna show you guys I don't know I feel like if I could do YouTube full-time that would be great because I have met a lot of people that have done it full-time or have quit their jobs and they just kind of like do maybe one or two days back at their old jobs but pretty much focus on YouTube that would be amazing because yeah, I feel like we live in a world now that YouTube or social media can be a job for some people and it's amazing. It's just more of trying to break that algorithm so that I can actually do it. But mm. So today I was surprised by this lovely package from CoverGirl. So I got these lippies. Usually how your social media works, or at least here in Australia, is we usually get a media blast, so that's like a mailing list. We just get a, a media blast asking if we want to try it, or it's just like general information about it, and then we can just send them an email asking for certain shades, certain products from this media blast. But this one was pretty out of the blue. I didn't expect this. I didn't even know these things came out. Let's try and do a close-up. So these are their Melting Pout um gel liquid lipstick Ooh, that's different so i'm not gonna swatch them for you guys now i think i'm gonna do another like swatching on instagram so if you guys would like to see swatches of these just make sure you guys are following me on instagram because i do plan on doing whenever i get um lipstick send outs i think i'm just gonna do instagram videos i think that's just easier than chucking it on youtube i don't think a lot of people actually look for swatches as much as they used to. I don't know. That's just what I'm going to go for at this point. Um, so yeah, if you guys are interested, definitely check out my Instagram page. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. I'm just combining this, obviously, with the previous vlog for when we went to the Christmas cave, because um, I don't think there's anything else that's going to be happening tomorrow. Um, it's just my partner and I are just going to stay home. I don't think we're going to do anything special, but we'll see. We'll see. I'm not really sure what's happening. Um, but yeah, there you guys go. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to thumbs up the video if you guys enjoyed and thank you so much for um, sharing so much love by the way for my exposing my old housemates video <laughs> like you guys really enjoyed that yeah i was just saying to my partner wow my followers really like it when i spilled the tea anyway thank you guys so much for watching i'll see you guys in the next video bye